catechism questions for our older kids focus on the sacrament of confirmation. Now, it's a little confusing because this is listed as the second sacrament. It's considered the second sacrament of initiation after baptism and before Holy Communion. But most of us receive Holy Communion before we receive confirmation. We do things kind of out of order. Uh, I can't really even begin to explain why in a short video. right? The sacrament of confirmation uh, is this kind of personal Pentecost when the Holy Spirit comes upon you in a new way. He comes on you in baptism. right? You receive the gifts of the Holy Spirit there. This is a strengthening of what's going on in baptism. And it strengthens us for what? To go out and fulfill our mission. So the Holy, the Holy Spirit and, and, the confirm, and the Sacrament of Confirmation is all about equipping you to go out and fulfill your mission that God hasn't given to anybody else. And that's why it's this big, fancy, special event. Often, right after Confirmation, you don't feel very different. You don't feel like you have all these new gifts and talents and strength and this new mission that you have to go out and fulfill. But often, shortly after Confirmation, those things start coming up. Right When the Spirit comes upon you and you're open to the graces of the sacrament, then you start being drawn towards other things. I can tell you in my own life, when I was in middle school and early high school, I was one of the shyest kids around. Straight A student, I would get red in the face just thinking about raising my hand to answer a question in class, even though I knew I was right. After my confirmation, the Lord gave me a gift of leadership, a spiritual gift of leadership and teaching. Uh, and he kept drawing me into these leadership roles that I was, frankly, wildly uncomfortable with. Until after a while, I started getting used to it and liking it and realizing I love teaching people about Jesus. <laughs> I love leading big churchy events like First Communions and Confirmation Masses and Vacation Bible Schools and Faith Formation and all that sort of stuff. I didn't know I had that in me until I was confirmed. And then shortly after that, God started unpacking that gift for me. So that's something you can look forward to in your own confirmation as the Spirit unfolds your gifts and your unique purpose in your life.